I'm somewhere in the middle Try to find myself again But life is one big riddle Good morning everybody and welcome to another video. What a beautiful day, the sun is shining. Today I thought I'll bring you along with me and we're going to do a little bit of bike tour. I thought we're going to have a look like and see what it looks like in Helsinki during these coronavirus times. I'm sure it'll be a little bit more quiet than it usually is on an Easter weekend. Look to the left, look to the right, nothing can stop me in the night like I am leaving all the bad stuff. And trying to remain so strong, I know it's good if I'm around, I got it. towards the shops or such or going for a walk but yeah it's pretty quiet isn't it so as you can see Finland was already prepared for social distancing look at these uh, public benches that they've got one two three already separated look to the left look to the right nothing So we're here now in pretty much the center of Helsinki and it's pretty quiet like, especially considering it's like the weekend you know I, I can maybe understand if it was like Sunday morning at 8 o'clock but we're like a Friday which is as I said it's a long weekend and it's midday so I think also in this park there would usually be quite a lot of people as well. There we go, how about this? The main shopping street in Helsinki. Look how... It's pretty odd, like... It's the first time I've been in the city and uh... I mean, I'm happy to see that people are taking it seriously and not so happy that businesses have to close down and everything, but uh, clearly everyone's doing what they can. But it's uh, pretty surreal, like, how quiet it all is over here. Normally there's like hundreds and hundreds of people down here around this time. And, yeah, there's two people I can see and also wouldn't be allowed to cycle along this footpath as well. Normally I'm coming down this street and I'm trying to avoid the smokers as much as possible. I mean, I would still be doing it now, but there's no one to avoid. <laughs> Yeah, you've heard me say it a lot already, but uh, yeah, it's pretty surreal being here in Helsinki and especially when it's such good weather and not seeing so many people on the weekend. I just actually really hurt my leg on the pedal sometimes and I was trying to stop the film something and then uh, put one foot down and then pedaled or something with the other one and the pedal whack, hit me right in the shin. Oh, it was really painful and sore and because I got these like uh, leg warmers on I thought oh, I was gonna be such a big deep cut underneath it and you know you tr start unraveling it up and looking and you're like oh please no please no actually it's all right I must have just been a little bit of a wimp and uh, it was pretty good the aim of today's ride is basically to just take it nice and easy uh, just one and a half hours easy pedaling and that's what we've been doing. I've been doing a little bit too much stopping, talking to the camera, filming things, but, you know, that's in the spirit of things. And, you know, I don't take everything too seriously. We're here for fun as well. Yeah, 
Spring's definitely arrived, hasn't it? Look at all these beautiful blossoming flowers. Whenever you take the drone with you, Mark, always pack a second battery. Aren't you always like that? I'm like this. I always try and pack light and try and take as little as possible. And well, today I thought, I'll, uh, I won't use the drone much. And you have this opportunity and you see all these beautiful things and places. And I just want to capture them and share them with everyone. And it's always a great day to have a good day, but I mean, when the sun's shining and it's a little bit warm and uh, it's peaceful as well, I actually enjoy that it's peaceful. So. Okay, so another stop on my little journey. Come to this really nice little Vietnamese restaurant in Helsinki called uh, Sen Che, and they do fully vegan stuff here. It's super cool. Here in Helsinki, all bars and restaurants have actually closed. They are only allowed to do takeaway and deliveries. So I've come here to support my local business, a uh, place that I enjoy and like. And I've been here many times, you've been watching my videos. So I've come here just to buy summer rolls, as they're called, or Vietnamese rolls, whatever you want to call them. And uh, so just to take home for delivery, not as snacks or as cycling. But support your local businesses as much as you can, buy gift vouchers, go and buy takeaway delivery, make a donation, whatever. We're all in this in different ways. It's not just affecting us through health and this. Obviously, that is one of the most important things, but people have a livelihood still to make. And uh, that I'm just doing my little bit. To be honest, I'm struggling for money myself, as you probably found out through recent news. But, you know, we can all get through this together, right? We're in this really nice little part of Helsinki where there's just loads of little wooden houses and you wouldn't think that you're in a capital city of a country but we are it's super peaceful just in general even without the covid times i mean look at these some houses and what's really nice about them is the colors of them they're all like different colors like yellows blues burgundies okay just them colors There we go, that wraps up another good ride. Today, what did we do? We ended up doing two and a half hours, 25 kilometers, and uh, average RA of 89 beats per minute. But hey, it's not always about the numbers. It's not always about statistics, and it's not always about you know how fast you've gone, how quick, and you know training, taking it all too seriously, looking at numbers. Sometimes it has to be about you know just being out there and enjoying it, and doing it for what you love. And if you're not doing that occasionally, or to be honest, even when I'm doing it for the numbers and everything, I'm enjoying it because that's what I enjoy to do. But you really need to be able to go out there and just, you know, not bother looking at the clock. Don't look at the numbers, don't analyze it. And just go and have fun. Go exploring, have some adventures. That's what's super important. And uh, I'd advise you to do that as well. Sometimes, you know, you don't, look, I took my watch out and just didn't bother looking at it. Didn't bother thinking about it. You don't have to not take your watch out with you. If that helps you, because uh, you you can't resist looking at it, then do, by all means do that. But uh, something I would really advise to you, just sometimes f let loose, have some fun, go run a marathon on your balcony, maybe not. But maybe, hashtag be like Mark. Post bike ride back at home and we're gonna hit the recovery. What have we got today? Yes, so we picked this up from that little Vietnamese place called Senche in Helsinki. Now look at this. Oh yeah. Some uh, vegan Vietnamese summer rolls with some sauce there. So I'm gonna enjoy these. 
put the feet up and catch up on some YouTube.